New at 10, a fight between a mother and Denver schools. More than $17,000 and a clerical snafu are at the center of it. 7 News reporter Mark Stewart is live. And Mark, you've now learned police are involved. And Teresa, according to this affidavit obtained by 7 News, the mother deposited the $17,000 check that was meant for someone else, but was accidentally made out to her son. Denver schools are demanding a payback. So far, the mother is refusing. The check for $17,763.25 was supposed to be sent to the Urban League of Metro Denver. Instead, according to this affidavit, it was sent to Michelle Clifton Nettle's son, a mistake according to the document. The woman's son was owed a check for less than $100, according to school officials, because he's a student employee in the athletic department. But account numbers got confused by the clerk, hence the $17,000 check. The mistake was realized three weeks later. A school investigator met with the woman. According to the affidavit, she gave him $2,000, all that was left. She said the remainder was spent on various bills and she bought her son a moped. Originally, she said she would pay the school system back, but now feels the money is hers and is getting a lawyer to fight having to pay it back. We made several phone calls and attempts to find the woman. We stopped by several addresses, in fact. Denver Schools tonight is not talking, but the affidavit requests bank records, which could be used in the future, depending on how this case moves forward. Live in the newsroom, Mark Stewart, 7 News.